Welcome back to Less Lonely Gaming. And, and as you can see behind me, we have the Sphinx that we just completed. In total, it has taken us an estimate of, uh, well, two days to complete this. And it's probably one of the largest scale projects that we've done so far. So, as soon as Juan has this, is finished showing actually the full scale size of this, which should be about uh, Excel may be around 80 to 100 blocks in length, and then 50 blocks in width. And then, uh, how high is it? It is 30 about, blocks high? I'm, I'm going to say it's about 20 to 30 blocks high. Fair estimate. Yeah. Now. And, I, and uh, it's taken us two days, but two days as in one whole afternoon, so that sums up to five to six hours. Safe yeah. To say. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then and, uh, th added three hours today. So and then we have done. Inside, we have uh, <laughs> prepared a bunch of stuff that we'll be looking forward to showing you. All right, then. Let's start. Oh, good. And this is a one way door that we created using redstone, uh, redstone repeaters, and redstone torches. We'll show how you can create one of these doors in a how-to video, which we'll hopefully be uploading within the next week. Now, let's continue. Please, cameraman, you go first. As you can this see, is this uh, from the stone pressure plate, we have, we have a repeating arrow trap. Luckily, we're in creative mode, so it's safe to go through. But otherwise, that would be very dangerous. And now here's the treasure hoard for getting through <laughs> the arrow trap. And, and that's the maze video. that we created. It took us a fair be deal of time. But since we already know where the exit is, it'll only take us a couple of seconds to get out. As you can see, we tried making a very nice spooky atmosphere. And here's the exit, as we all can see. Good. And here's the tomb of some forgotten pharaoh that we made. <laughs> oh good no. Uh, the city is... <laughs> it's disgusting. Uh, <laughs> and that was the Sphinx that we have completed. And our next project will be the Eiffel Tower. It'll probably take us a couple of days to complete, so look forward to it. That's all I can say. Over and out. Game over.